Understanding Open Pollinated, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating term in the world of gardening and agriculture, open pollinated. This concept is not only interesting but also quite important in understanding how plants reproduce and are cultivated. Let's dive into it and unravel its meaning together. Open pollinated refers to a method of plant pollination that occurs naturally. This means the plants are pollinated by natural mechanisms like wind, insects, birds, or even by hand, without any human intervention in controlling the genetics of the plants. This process results in seeds that are more genetically diverse. Why is this important? Because it allows plants to adapt to local growing conditions and develop unique characteristics. In this section, we'll compare open pollinated plants with hybrid plants. Hybrids are created when breeders intentionally cross-pollinate two different varieties of a plant, aiming to produce a plant that contains the best traits of both parents. Unlike open pollinated plants, hybrids do not produce true-to-type seeds. This means if you plant seeds from a hybrid plant, the new plants may not have the same qualities as the parent plant. Let's talk about why open pollinated plants are beneficial. These plants are valued for their genetic diversity and adaptability. They often become more resilient to local pests, diseases, and climate conditions. Also, gardeners and farmers can save seeds from these plants year after year, which is cost-effective and helps in preserving plant varieties. I hope this video has been informative and helped you understand the meaning of open pollinated. It's a term that encapsulates a natural, diverse, and sustainable approach to plant growth. Thank you for watching, and keep exploring new words and concepts to enhance your English language skills. See you in our next video.